fans of engaged women has changed quite significantly over the last uh, three or four years. It's a privilege to be here when you can attend Wimbledon, but what's important for the fans outside of the, the campus here is that they get that full immersive experience. In 2011, we had almost a half a million visitors through the doors. We also had over three quarters of a billion TV viewers across 129 TV channels in 173 countries and nearly 16 million unique users to our website. The viewers expect more than just being entertained and almost sort of watching in a passive way. Uh, they have a relationship with the players, have a relationship with the tournament, they're very hungry for information and statistics. They're very demanding these days, whether you're using a tablet device, whether you're accessing Wimbledon from TV or from your, your laptop or radio. You know, people want that continuity of experience. Social media has been really important and it's rapidly evolved over the last three or four years. That's changed the way Wimbledon is accessed. We engage with our fans through mobiles, iPads or, or their PCs or, or through the broadcast stream or the 450 million page views that we had in 2011. 27% of those came from mobile. The new website is very exciting. Working with, with IBM, our partners, we were very keen to really bring the narrative of Wimbledon to as many users as we possibly could. And this year, for the first time, we'll be streaming snapshots of live play via Live at Wimbledon service. For the fans, is that they get much more embedded, much more interlocked experience and a stickiness almost as though they were here. Yeah, there's a huge infrastructure that sits behind this. It needs that flexibility, um, and certainly that's what you know, IBM give us. Cloud offers a huge amount of elasticity in terms of the workloads on the infrastructure. In 2009, when the US Golf Open overran uh, into the first day of Wimbledon, we were able to uh, match the demands on the system and be able to provide uh, continuous service to both tournaments in parallel. We've been working with IBM now for over 23 years. Uh, the whole idea is to make sure we stay ahead of this curve, engage more with our, with our fans. It's actually a very good partnership working with Wimbledon in that IBM can bring the technology and the more emerging uh, elements of how technology can assist them. I don't think we could achieve um, the type of engagement we want with the fans without a partner like IBM and our strategy with IBM is not just to look at the current championship or the sort of one, next one or two championships, which is to future-proof our experience so we're looking about how we engage with fans over the next five to ten years.